The Chiefs were missing a pair of superstars this morning on the practice field, but Brandon Zenner tells us about a player making a name for himself. Well, we are just about there. Just one day remains in Chiefs training camp out here at Missouri. Watching on Wednesday morning, Frank Clark missing yet again with a sore wrist. Sammy Watkins was ill today. He did not take the field. One guy who did take the field, Breland Speaks. He had a pick for the second straight day of Patrick Mahomes playing in a 4-3 under Steve Spagnuolo, a fit he likes very much. They're pretty much going from a lot of defense to just enough defense where, I mean, Spagnuolo's style is uh, we we attack and then we, we, he let his players play. It's just his basic football to me. Speaks and Tano Passano struggled to adapt and find the field under Bob Sutton, but the dividends are quickly showing in a new defense. Brilliant's in that rotation with the first group there. They they kind of throw fastballs at you, and and um, he can play. The great thing about Brilliant is he can play inside or outside. Um, he's working on different rush moves. I mean, I feel like it's, it's finally coming full circle for me. Well, in the NFL, you got to have a couple more pitches that you throw, so um, he's been working on those. Speaks and Passano tallied seven in the preseason opener, giving a glimpse into what could be. Yeah, I mean, he went out there and got him one, so I was like, hey, <laughs> I need to go get me one. You can't one-up me. It was just fun to finally get out there and uh, just rush. Now back and showing why the Chiefs thought so highly of him at Ole Miss, he's proving himself that he's right. That I didn't get here on my state, uh, that I actually did come from a system that allowed me to play, uh, that allowed me to uh, do what I do best, and then getting out here, being able to do it, just reaffirmed everything that I already knew. Reporting out of Missouri Western, Brandon Zenner, News Press Now Sports. And we'll have more in sports on this tonight at 6 on News Press Now.